Hi, this is Reading with Mrs. Naki, Lesson 4. If these videos are helpful, please hit like and subscribe. Thanks. Okay, first word for Lesson 4, we find the vowels. Here's our A. We put a V below that for vowel, a U, a V below that for vowel, and draw the bridge. The next thing we look, and we have to identify our consonants on the bridge, but I have three consonants this time. And I can only identify two consonants. That means when there's more than two, that a couple of them are going to go together to make a blend or a digraph. So in this case, the DR is the blend. So you underline the DR and put one C below that. The N is the other consonant. Now we have our pattern. And now we can see we split between the two C's. So we start from the bottom and draw our line up. Get our scissors, cut on the line, flip it, tape it, flip it back. Now let's isolate those syllables. We see that there is a consonant after the vowel, so it's closed makes a short A sound. I go to the other side. I see there is a consonant after the vowel. It's closed, makes a short U sound. And then I can read D, An, Dan, Dr, Uff, Druff. Read it together. Dan, Druff, Dan, Druff. Okay. Next word. Find our vowels. We have an I and an E. Draw our bridge. Again, we have three consonants, but I can only put two C's on there. So I know the DR will go together. I underline the DR and then I put a C for consonant under there. The N is my other consonant. And then now I can split my word starting from the bottom between the two C's. I draw my line up. Notice I'll never draw a line and cut between something that I've underlined. Now for this lesson, I want you to understand I told you the blend, but as we move forward and words become more difficult, we'll practice thinking out loud about how to decide what is the blend? Today, I want you to understand that when you have something that goes together, it needs to be underlined and identified as one consonant. Let's isolate those syllables. There is a consonant after the vowel. Therefore, it's closed and it makes a short I sound. There is a consonant after the vowel, therefore it's closed and it makes a short E sound. Now I can read it. Kin, dread, kindred, kindred. Good. All right. Good luck dividing words into syllables. I know you can do it.